What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to YGOPD, you get professional development. I got my boy Grant here with us today. Um, this is something I've never had the chance to do. I've always wanted to open a case. This is my first formal case opening. This is his case. Uh, big shout out to him. He has been grinding locals for credit, collecting bulk. Like he's just been on a mission to get this set. And if you've seen the case openings, the rarity distribution, you know it's really needed. So I won't say too much. You've seen some stock footage in the beginning of the whole case, but we'll just start opening. So let's get into it. Let's get it, brother. Let's get it. And I also heard that a rumor, not a mm. rumor, but I also tested this. Yeah. And it did prove true with a lot of boxes that the secrets are in the either sixth or seventh slot on both sides of the box. Interesting, interesting. Most people have seen everything, so I'm just really just yep. going to set aside supers. If you want to see commons or things like that, MST TV is always, I think, good for that. The big sponsored creators, right, that show the the individuals are solid. You know, out of the two boxes I got, I didn't pull a single Desire, the Fiend Smith super that I just read. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I have a ton of those. Really? Yeah. And I'm sure we'll get more. Yeah, yeah. Give me a puppet. Dude, this card is, is is pretty good. The Dipsy Fiend. Oh, the uh, the, the new one? Yeah, for like Plunder, Valmonica. Like, it's just random. U-Bell, like, uh, it works for a lot of stuff. All right, let's see here. Hey, Patrick's calling me right now. Sorry, bud. <laughs> He's been Man. floating at the beach all day. Ooh. Lucky guy. The Cape May. Right, first ultra. Ooh, okay. There you go. White woods, solid. Yeah, white woods. Oh, I'm right behind you there with the. That the, card's actually very. Good. Yeah, for the rabbit. Yeah. yeah, the rabbit's been holding a lot more value than what I thought. Have you read the new Drytron card? They're all it's, really like, good. This set, guys, is insane. Insane for power creep. The game is really going to speed up now. All right, moving some trash more out. Mini of the way Are you looking to grab some of that stuff, the Mimi Ghoul stuff? I am, yeah. I have most of it. So let's rabbit Ooh, is the first secret. Oh, there you go. That's and, not terrible. And that was, in fact, one, two, three, four, five. That would have been the sixth pack. All right, I should be pretty close to behind you here in another pack or two if we're going that direction. Oh, wait, I think I grabbed on the other side, so I might have two back-to-back -back secrets eventually. Oh, let's see. Lord Super. of the Missing Barrows. This card's also good. I haven't read that one. That's the card uh, me and Sonny were talking about. Is it like you banish the one of it's each? Yes, you banish yeah, the one yeah. of each, and then it does the same on the field. It banishes one monster, and then two spells and traps, or something like that, or destroys. Uh, yeah, banish it banishes from the field. Uh, the new Sinful Spoils Super. Yeah, I still have not bothered to read that card. Nor have I. Uh, Mimi Ghoul. Man's just been grinding over here with no no secrets. I know. Right? It's okay. We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. I'm not worried. Yeah, the Mimigal stuff, it's not bad. Oh, uh, there's your uh, other Ultra. Yeah. yeah, yeah. D-Bell Star. It's not terrible. Honestly, I think I think the Ultra is really, it's just what, Caveman, and then probably the Whitewood Search spell are the main ones. There might right. be another one that's a little bit of Which one, I didn't pull any at Sneak or see anyone that actually pulled those. Oh, really? Um, the, the Whitewood's Ultra mm. Searcher. Yeah, I didn't see that either, which kind of surprised me. All right, I'm bleeding into the second half of the box here with no secret, so we'll we'll probably pull one here soon. Yeah, yeah, Wall of, wall of Odds. Nope, super. XD. It feels so good to just be surrounded by product to open. I can't <laughs> yeah, dude. It feels so good. Totally worth. Ooh, baby! Oh, baby. Is. That's oh, a great first start geez, to the first box, dude. The one box wonder Insane. continues his run. Let's get this back Ladies and gentlemen. Trying to move it backwards. There we go. Engraver. Wild, dude. Let's go. All right, I'm going to set this great separately. Start. Yep. We got a Genroku. It's not bad at all. No. I mean, hey, every engraver you pull is a little bit more than a box. 
It's a lot more. <laughs> fat. Yeah. Are they? I saw they were like 135 like a day or two ago, they're, and then they're now holding at 116 today. That's that's so still it's still 35 wild. more than a box, yeah, or 30 more wild. than a box. Sorry. Oh, bro, rabbit. X, <laughs> dude, XD. Another rabbit. I've also found that sil uh, rabbit and Fiendsmith is like a super common box opening. Really? Yeah. Like if you see a rabbit, then it's a high possibility that you will be seeing engraver, mm. and vice versa. If you open the engraver first, there's a high possibility that, that next secret will be a rabbit. Yeah. Oh, bro. Bro, no, bro, no, bro, shot. Bro, 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 no bro. shot. Hold on, hold, hold, no hold, 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 shot. Hold, hold, no hold, shot, hold, no hold, shot, no hold, shot, no shot, no shot. Hold, 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 hold. And I just I'm about to destroy my whole setup. Engraver, please. Oh, hey, 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 that's geez. pretty good. Wild. That's so clean, bro. That's Look insane, at that. Insane, dude. That's so oh, it's beautiful. Good. God, that's oh my word. I told you, man. Gorgeous. You just gotta let me open a box. Gorgeous. Love Whew. it. Love it. Great start. Tremendous. Absolutely insane. Dude. Whoa, sheesh. Well, 11 more to go, bud. <laughs> yeah, 10 more to go. Right. Yeah, actually yeah. the two of us. Yeah, 10 more. Uh, Secret Diabelles. That's good. That's not bad. Not no, bad at not. all. It's, it's <laughs> not. Yeah, like it could always be worse, I think. 100%. I yeah, it could probably... be an onk. Could be an onk. <laughs> yeah. What's crazy though is the onk is still a little bit, and I feel bad. I gave mine away to Sonny because I was just like, I don't need this. Well, you know, he'll, he'll, he'll pay it back. It's he always whatever. Does. Yeah, it's fine. If you ever need something. Shout out Sonny though. I want to see him. Shout out Sonny P. Stuff. Yeah, dude. Hopefully, uh, next case opening, we can all be there. Yep. Oh, we got a wedge you. Wedge you temple. Ooh. I've actually never read this card, wedge you temple. Have you? Uh, it like. Let's you recycle them mainly. Like you can put one back in the spell trap zone again. Oh, it's just the Millennium Field. Oh, there's another uh, White Woods Ultra. Oh yeah, the book. That's a common one. That one's not bad. I mean, it's decent because you need at least two of it for White Woods because you can summon two in one turn. The one box actually I did open, I got uh, three Ultras. Hmm. Which is a shame because it could have been a third secret, that but it was still really cool. I mean, at least you didn't get short of a secret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've also seen that happening to people. Oh, I just realized we zoomed in for Requiem. Now no one's just been seeing anything. XD. That's okay. You didn't need to see anything after that, Big right? Facts. That was, Big that was nothing. Highlight. Nothing worth. Uh, yeah. Nothing worth that yet. <laughs> yeah. There's gonna be mountains of cards. Yeah, dude. It's just... I did the math, dude, and a and a case is like twenty six hundred and ninety two cards. Like something insane. like that. Yeah, it's like actually insane. You just get a full load of bulk. Yeah. <laughs> With every case. I need I need to stress that to people who have not uh, seen that. It's like you need to collect bulk. Oh, there you go. There's the White Wood Search spell. Oh, there we go. Not yeah. bad. Very uh, very solid little. Varsh Var at the end. Varshy balls. Oh, you're on your second box. Man. We're speedy demons over here. I need to. I need to get another piece of wood to put under this to adjust my uh, mic because it's just always been a tad in butterfly. play. That card is really good for. Is like, it? Like a, I, was, I haven't read. I was talking to our before. buddy that plays the deck, and it. it yeah, shout out Jamar. Dude. Shout out Jamar. His deck's gonna. Oh, dude, I just be unlimited gas there you now. Go. Another mini All right, I'm gonna make some space here, clean some stuff up. We got a Mimi Cool Dungeon. Oh, there you go. If that deck gets a good second wave of support, it's going to be a pretty degenerate sun deck, I'll be honest. Yeah. Which it's been a while since we've had one of those, though. Labyrinth has been trying. Yeah. Flu was there for a bit. Uh, do we really consider Flu and Ariza control deck? I don't know. Maybe. I don't even know what we consider that deck, honestly. It's trash. Bad. Yeah, I think is the answer. There's Maker. Dark Magic Mirror Force. I think this is six or seven here. We've got a... We have a second engraver. Oh, baby. Who, buddy? Is that your... That's your second box. I'm on my second box now. Yeah. So, so far, two out of four boxes, dude. That's... Two uh, out of four boxes engravers. 50% engraver pull rate is, is insane, actually. Pretty insane. We got a maker. Super. 
I how many QC how many, Requiem insane, dude. How many QCs play. per case did you say there was? Uh, oh, there's a money. I'm I sure. think on average it's two to three. That's not bad. Um, I've seen some with four and five. So that's... Yeah. New memento support that deck's going to be a problem. Yeah, it wasn't bad. I mean, it wasn't as good as I thought it was going to be. But if you haven't picked it up, you should now. For whatever reason, at YCS Indie, bone parties were thirties. Now they're like fifteen, or at least they were. Dear Lord, Mimigul Master is an ultra. Keep the ultras secret separate. Good facts. Good facts. I am probably close to a secret. No, not yet. We'll probably do a hard reset trying. after we each finish this box that we're on. Yeah, for sure. It'll only take like 30 seconds. The random rank four, no one will ever play. Can I pop that? Gimmick Puppet is just way less consistent than what I thought it was going to be, which is, is very sad. Oh, dude! Track. Oh, there we go. Track, sadly, is only like 20 bucks now. Is it really? Yeah, it's really I mean, it's really still one you down. need, so. It is. It's, it's part of the Fiendsmith engine, which is needed. A lot of people are like three engraver, one track. I'm like, I'm just picking up three and three. Like, I, I, I'm going to have three just because I want to test it. But, yeah. I, I mean, I, again, I think... For now, I think everyone kind of has a general idea of what the deck's going to be doing. Yeah. I mean, what's... Uh, Here you go, sir. Oh, whoa, <laughs> there you go. What's the... Um, That's for you. I'll just... I'll, whoa, 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 XD. Later. That's true. What's the second highest secret after Engraver? Is it something uh, It other is Molt Charmy. Oh, yeah, duh. Moltrami. Well, I'm after those two. Is it just track? Oh, there's a Dominus oh, Purge. That's not bad. That card's a good card, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. This is a good Bro, card. Bro, I... People are just going to not listen. They're, they're going to listen to what they want. But I talked about Black Goat last, and that card was like $2. No one picked it up. Now they're almost like 20 bucks. I, it's going to be the same for the do you purge. Do for this? Uh, I do. Yeah, hold on. Let me grab that. Uh, I'll be in a second, Tim. Tim number two. Exod. If you finish that box and I'm not done, I'll give you half a mind to open up. Uh, White Woods Ultra. Not oh, bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. That's good card. Good card. Mini Ghoul. Got a Dark Magician of the Magician oh, the... of Black Magic Magician Dark. <laughs> <laughs> Shining the shining Sark deck, dude. That just is terrible. Uh, it's yeah. It's so what, sad, it's, too. It is. It is. I get that they were trying to like relive Yugi's glory days, but sadly, oh, we're in a white forest. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it's not that card's not really played. That's not. Good. You probably sided or something. Eventually, eventually. I'm interested to see what comes from this Whitewood stuff. I'm really excited to play it. That's what I'm really excited to play and right Exod now. Exod is the last one. There you Exodia. go. I'm probably playing White Woods more until the ban list just to have fun. And then I'll put Fiendsmith in every other deck after that. Yeah, dude, I cannot wait to test Fiend, Fiendsmith Race. Shout out to all my subscribers who are just going to unsub because they're going to see Fiendsmith dot every single deck. And I'm like, well, sorry. Uh, the Rabbit uh, Trap is the other Ultra. Here, and I'll hand you. There's probably at least an Ultra and a Secret left in that stack. Oh, ho, ho. Yes, Papa. So I've pulled, I've pulled <laughs> what, three secrets so far? That was Rabbit, Engraver, and Track. That's been pretty Indeed. solid. That has been... Oh, dude, no, QC. QC. No shot. And it's a spell. Oh, it's a spell. That means it's probably Mini Ghoul. Dungeon? Yep, Dungeon uh, again. Oh, dude. I mean, Dungeon's not bad, bro. No, it's no, It's low, no. but, like, it's still not bad. No, People but... will want it because of the engine. They'll just want to bling but it I'm out. I'm just saying, man. The Ultra is also a QC, so yeah. I mean, it's, a, it's a card that people... Yeah, it's pretty good. Cards that people will want. Maltrami Perilia. Dude. So far, we've just been insane. We've been lighting it up, brother. Two engravers in Maltrami plus two QCs out of four boxes in is wild. Yeah, we're 
We're looking. We're looking Here. mighty good. Got another stack another of bulk load. for you. Another yep. load of bulk. If you guys see a couple cuts throughout here, just know, like, my, my Nikon camera, it has to, like, turn off to avoid overheating. So it's just, like, I'm just going to pause and restart. But obviously, you're going to see everything sealed still and, and continue to, Absolutely. to open. Lord of the Missing Barrows. You know what? While you're doing that, I'm going to grab some sleeves. Oh, yeah. That's a good idea. I have some in my bag, too. I like, whole, open boxes. Uh, I got a whole tin. Oh, excuse me. Of just spare sleeves. We've got a Tales of the White Forest. Ooh, there you go. There you go. People can see some of the progress, dude. And then a memento, and it's the final one out of that box. You see. All right, I'm going to pause for a sec, guys, and then we'll just cut back. Just have them pick stuff up and then just gradually I guess, keep yeah. it together, I suppose. I mean, to be fair, regional season is months away, and if you're not going to Nats, that's no true. one's There's really no in a really. rush for yeah. it to get it, to be honest. Start sleeping these ultras up while you crack those. Yeah. I'll give more sleeves. Uh, I, didn't, yeah, yeah, I didn't realize these were already all sleeves. I got you. XD. Oh, thank you, sir. Yep. I think you're right. And I also think it's interesting sometimes when you see patterns like that, right, of where the secret is, that like the whole case at least is like seated. Consistent, yeah. That way. Too. Yeah. And while I've heard a lot of like mixed opinions on that yeah. from people, I think it's good because it guarantees consistency within the product. And while we all complain about Konami and quality control, um, you know, that is something that at least shows that they are making an effort to be consistent. Um, yeah. You know. I mean, for me, uh, Whitewoods Ultra, the biggest consistency I've seen recently is, I don't know if people remember a couple sets ago, I think it was when Chimera came out. Um, was that Dune? Dune or Legacy or, or Lead, but like all the cards were just damaged straight out of the pack. Like comments were Dune. torn and that was stuff. Dune. Yeah, it was just... Dune was really bad. Made me sad. It was a bad set in general. But. Yeah, well, that too. <laughs> that too. And starting off a new box on this side, Lord of the Missing Barrows. Yeah, if, if it's all seated the same way, I'm probably pretty close to a, to a secret. Who knows, man? Maybe maybe your box just has six QCRs, dude. One every other box. Dude, that would be... That's what we're looking for. <laughs> I'd like to pull one. <laughs> oh, well, you knew what you got into when you had me open your product. For people who don't know the lore that uh, don't know me personally, when he got Agov, I pulled his QC Little Knight, which was yeah. actually insane. That was absolutely Asteria, insane. not terrible. Oh, yeah, yeah, not terrible. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's about 20 bucks. Huh? Yeah, it's, it's the higher of the two, which surprises me because this is the normal summon, and I would have thought the other one would have been worth more. The, the, the extender the never is worth as much as the normal summon. But it's just like, yeah... But like the, I don't know. I guess for me, I just think like again, similar to Fiend Smith, right? Comboing without your normal summon is good. Sure. All oh, this pack came out upside down. <laughs> Nothing. No. Oh. <laughs> Bro, it's just cards that are just all turned around in that pack. Oh dear. Strike what I said about uh, Konami's quality yeah, control. Right. <laughs> They're not damaged, so it's fine. That's good. Another Genroku. Oh, there you go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad. How much is Genroku? Oh, they're like, I think between like 12 and 14 right now. That's better than what I thought. Yeah, they'll probably end up at like 10, would yeah. be my guess. Kind of like Poplar tier. Yeah. <laughs> That's also true. Oh, another Genroku. Oh, XD. Got a Cerberus on the side. You might want to move yours up just a, a touch when you open. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I see that. I haven't been paying attention too much, but... I'm going to have to maneuver around the microphone. Yeah, do what you need to do. We got a Dominus Purge as a secret. Oh, there you go. Solid. Box here. I might be able to, if this doesn't fall... Oh, there we go. Uh, maybe we'll we'll find out if people can still hear it or not. If not, you know you're gonna hear some music or some random thing in the background. 
some elevator tunes. While yeah, they... <laughs> literally. <laughs> then just death metal every time we pull a QCR <laughs> secret. Now they do gotta play the master goal music, dude. Yeah. The big I, is that copyright free? Apparently, because no everyone uses it. I I'm feel like, like everyone does. It's funny how much copyright stuff I get from YouTube for being like a super small channel, and I'm like, that's what happens when you pay for like licensing and stuff. Yeah. You know what I might do? I might uh, tilt tilt the camera a bit more. Yeah, see yeah. if I can do that. While you're <laughs> opening stuff. That would be board for another silhouette hat trick. Let's see if it cuts off. Yeah, it's better. Mimigool. Mimigool. Mimigools. Bob Monica. Bro, the same like weird pendulum Angel ultra, Sunny dude. Ones. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, I'm glad someone does because it's like. I've been thinking about column cards like Iron Dragon, Tiamaton, and stuff. Just because now the game, it's like you can't play around columns in the sense of like boards just have two cards in every like yeah, zone. Yeah, everything. The full boards. Shield of the Millennium. Shield's not bad. I haven't seen a Senegin yet, have we? No. Yeah, no uh, no Caveman or, yeah, Senegin Sen Sen or whatever it is. I keep calling it by the old name. I can't remember if I have one more secret in this box. I think I do. Yeah, I just pulled I, one I, one Asteria. Where will be? In these last few, that's where it's going to be. It's going to be an engraving. Makes me hope so. You know what would have been really hilarious? Is if that Moon of the Closed Sky... Oh, oh well, the Whitewoods box. There you go. Okay. Asteria yeah. and Elzat. Whatever. you got to have a little bit of... Variance. Yeah. A little bit of mid. A little bit of non-mid. Elzad is Elzad. <laughs> yeah, 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 there it is. Uh, it's okay. We got a lot of boxes to keep pulling engravers. Big facts. Big facts. Oh, Monica. The way of the wyman. I forget what I was saying. I don't even know. I don't even remember. Archfiend. Oh, uh, that's backwards. More Mimi Ghouls. I got two and more. Another. Yeah. Scale. Oh, there you go. Oh. Tang and Jin. There it is. Our uh, caveman boy. There's the man. The man, the myth, the legend. For people who need budget stuff, I mean, that's it's three free link material. That deck at the cost of 6k life. I mean, you gotta have the stuff to go into, of course, but it's something. All right, that's my box. My box is gone. Move the supers. And then I'll probably sleeve up. I'll let you sleeve up these guys here. Oh, yeah, for sure. Cerberus. You know, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna do. Watch, one. we'll get a Millennium one. I mean, if it's Sangin Jin, I won't care. That's also fine. Could, if it's like that's that's the playable one. So, did Alex give you that stuff? Uh, he did. I have. A, I have. A good. Thing. You'll see a couple of new things, <clears throat> videos coming on the channel. I'm trying to build like plunder. Seems really cool with the Dipsy Fiend and stuff. Like. There's a lot of fiend decks I never explored that just seem worth to explore now with, uh, even with or without fiend smith. Like I think when you get sets like this, you have such a, a, a like a divide in the community with a lot of competitive players, but then also a lot of casual people. Right. You don't need to go that far up, I don't think. Oh well, maybe you do. I'm trying That's to see. Yeah, I do that. Oh yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, center yeah. is what I need to do. Oh yeah, yeah, you can even go like about here. You'd be fine. I'm work my way under there. Oh, there we go. Got your angle. There we go. Resilia. That's yeah, not bad. Barrows. 
Tear Force. Never read that card. Probably will still never read that card. Dark Magic Tear Force. Yeah, you just definitely get the feeling there's always just some cards that you're just like, this is never going to see play ever. Yep. Uh, Lad, or not Lad, I think about Lad, but Light and Darkness. Uh, I think about Lad every day. I do. <laughs> I do. That card was crazy back in the day. It was. It was good times. Oh, there it is. Oh, dude, the bottom of the barrel. The um. That's big sad. It's okay. I'll pull a secret that will be better. I just like a QC, please. Yeah. <laughs> I, I would like to pull a QC. You gotta be uh, more specific. Case, I'd like be to pull more. an engraver, please. Yeah, there I'd you like go. Pull a QC, QC yeah, you gotta be, you gotta I be more specific. I already pulled one engraver, regular engraver. I need uh, another QC engraver, please. Oh, uh, there's your uh, White Witch. White Woods. Well, there'll be plenty of that. Yeah. We need something in this box to make up for the onk. We need a we need a big hitter. We need something to liven this up here. We've been yeah. We've been coasting true. for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Started off on a high. Started off with just gas. Yeah. Straight gasoline. Yeah, we, we rolled the roller coaster. You got to get back in line. You got to climb it's true. back up. We do have to. I think we got stuck on the big way up, dude, and they're, yep. they're trying to fix us so yep. we can finish the ride. Yeah. Need... Okay, this is a half, so. Might just be a super. It might just be one ultra, one secret on each half of the box. I need two. On another White Woods ultra. Engrave upon this day. That's what I need to do. Yeah. I'm gonna keep saying the word engrave, and hopefully that's a dungeon. <laughs> <It is. laughs> yeah. Engrave. Right, right, exactly. Ready to say a little bit louder. I've not gotten the secret out of this box. I'm the owed other one. one more secret and two more ultras, I think. Well, I'm, I'm owed something after that onk. Yeah. Let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> We've got them all charming. There you go. There we, that's, good, that's good, exactly good, good. Excellent. I always forget about that card in this set. Yeah. I think about Smith. I'm like pleasantly surprised. Also, I just need to do this. This card, if I can pick it up carefully, I think is one of the best looking it's definitely Secret very rares clean. printed in a long time. Like I think this card looks. I think that of engraver really too. Good. I think the secrets in this set look very good. Yeah. Even Ankh looks really good. Right. Ankh reminds me of just Kokimiru back in the day because you literally just keep mm. it in hand and reveal it for stuff. It's kind of crazy that like you play that and you play all five pieces of Exodia in that deck. I'm like that's just like all brick of the bricks. City. Yeah. Brick, brick City. Unless you're Jeff Jones. Apparently. Yeah. Apparently. Dark Magician. Yeah. Mimigul Master. Secret here. Any, any, yeah, yeah. Uh, any pack now. No. No, just a w the worst of all of the mimic ghoul cards. Oh. Servers. I will say, I have not pulled a Mulchami yet. That's true. Ooh! Requiem. That's Requiem. good. Not terrible. Not terrible. That is good. Those are welcome, welcome additions. My pulls have been very Fiendsmith focused and Whitewoods focused. Yeah. One, one engraver, one Requiem, one Traps. Plus QC Requiem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Insane. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, right, right. How could I forget? Can we get a box with three secrets? I, I opened... What? What? Uh, was that tier format? I can't forget. I forget what box. But it was within the last, like, year. Yeah, so it I was had, Darkwing Blast. That's what... Yeah, the first box I'd ever opened three secrets out of. And I was like, I just didn't think it was real. And I was like, this is crazy. Now they're going the opposite way. <laughs> yeah. Boxes with one secret is Alone insane. Secreto. I will do that if you give me a QCR in the box. Sure. As the chase card only. Oh, White Woods. I think that's your playset now. Yeah, that White is White Woods uh, Searcher. Paradise. And that's uh, that's my box. What's crazy to me is a lot of people um, are like, ah, well, you know, not bad for one case getting like two engraver, two track. I'm like, no, not bad. Terrible for one case. If I'm dropping $1,000 on a set, I expect to get a play set of every card in the set. Yeah. I don't think that's privileged when I'm spending that much money. I think Fact. that's like the bare minimum. Like Konami, please. Um, here. Oh, there's uh, some bulk for you. I'll get a new tin. For people who want to just see the, uh, no one's probably going to even see this part, but people who just want to see the results, I'll do a cut at the end, um, and also do a community post like a day later, because I need you guys to watch the video first. XD. Oh, there we go. I mean, plus, honestly, guys, doesn't it feel good just to like see Chill. what people are pulling so you can get more information? There's the Oh, engraver. baby! Third engraver, let's go. Play set of engraver already. As I was saying, it does feel good. Uh, <laughs> it does feel good to get a return <laughs> on your investment. That it does. That it does. Definitely going to be looking to uh, to move a lot of this. Yeah. So if you're in the area, it will be moved. It will, in fact. If you know us, it will. It will be gone very soon. QC engraver. Come on. That's a dungeon. Every time I say engraver, it's like dungeon. Yeah, I know. Stop saying it. <laughs> dungeon. <laughs> yeah, dungeon. There you go, yeah. Dungeon. And then you're going to get a QC dungeon. <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, yeah, again, right. You already pulled a QC dungeon. I did. In addition to this one, too. So I pulled two already at this point. We just sold the first one on, on the pole. At the sneak. It'd be really good out of these last, what, three box? No, four boxes. Yeah. yeah. That we pull at least one more QC would be really, really solid. Oh, for sure. I think we will. There's a good chance. I will say, too, it's been cool to see how people are messing with Mimigools in different so, capacities. Uh, like, people are playing Mimigool Room in uh, Vanquish Soul. Mm. Because you give them a face down monster and then Zhao Long can, can manually flip something on their turn. So you just flip it up and, like, board wipe them. And it's just an earth attribute. So it's not terrible. I think the one thing that's kind of sad about Mimigool is they're always like, oh, dude, it's going to go in every flip deck. But, like, it just functions differently than every flip deck, so you just can't do that. Oh, there you go. Exodia. 
That's the first one of these guys I've pulled. Let's see. It's also sad that Centurion card is just not good, to my understanding. Yeah. I was like, they were doing great with every wave of support, and then they were just like, no. It also shocks me now, too, how, like, Gimmick Puppet, Centurion, Brandy, like, all the decks that can turn skip, it's just no longer good enough to do that, which is actually funny to me. Facts. Well, I think they've just been passed up, you know. Yeah. Yeah, it's also true. Man, have you read, like, the, some of the, like, a have you read some of these commons, dude? Dominus. I mean, some of these commons. Not bad. Not bad. I guess play set of those now. Yep. That That's going to be in White Woods, too. Yeah. Uh, well, it's going to be in a lot of decks. Yeah, yeah. Dominus is a good card. What were you saying if I read? Uh, If you've read some of the commons from this set, dude. Like, I some know. of them are just so insane. Yeah, the Coca-Chobo, whatever. The, the Link heck? 5 plant that just, like, permanently becomes yeah. large and giant. Yep, that. Oh, the, the Divine Tree? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I did a video on that. Oh, did you? I was surprised because I realized, I was like, I shouldn't have done that because it was actually leaked. But uh, oh, XD. It's, a, it's a generic Link 5. It sucks that it's a Link 5, but it's any any deck can now has a time card they can make if yeah. they can Link one, which I think is, is cool. Without needing to play, like, extra bricks. You just make yeah, the Or, like, five. Dogwood. Yeah, 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 yeah. I uh, got the Rabbit Ultra. I pulled that. I pulled that a lot. I think that's our third third Rabbit Ultra. You're on your last box. Or, yeah, you're on your last box. Let me pull a QCR, please. <laughs> I will pull the QCR engraver. And it will and it will be yours. Ragnarika. Yeah, I'm interested to see how far they push the whole trap monster thing with the rabbit and some of the new stuff they've done. Oh, I got an upside down pack, I think. Medulce. I haven't even, I don't know if I've even pulled that card. Maybe I just didn't pay attention. It's actually good. The Medulce stuff is pretty good. That's almost heard. There's, there, I mean, yeah, you were right. There's a good few things to buy out for Vernacell, like a few few decks. Oh, I just saw it. Yeah, I just saw it. It started getting bought out. Oh, I forgot to move that. I forgot to gather all that stuff up. Mm, I'm going to do that again. I'm going to yeah. do that when I get home. If I owned the Medulce stuff, I would play it, but that I'm not doing that. Would you? Oh, would you? There you go. I should be coming up on another secret here soon. On Let's get that third Mulcharmy or that fourth engraver. I'm big, we'll I'm big on the fourth engraver. Real big on that. Preferably QCR. Oh, Bro, oh, 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 it's a QCR oh, Let's yeah. go. There you go. You pulled the QC. I did, I did, in fact, pull a QC. And sadly, yes, it was an ultra. Well, it's still a QC, though. I mean... Even the, I mean, this is this is the search one. This is pretty, uh, pretty. We're gonna, have a, lot, we're gonna have a lot of QC Whitewood stuff by the. I know, dude. It makes me makes me triggered that I just cannot afford that. Plus, Beansmith. XD. Yeah. It's like, hey, I didn't pick up Beansmith. I just bought QC Whitewoods instead. Like the entire QC core for one Beansmith. Whatever floats your boat. Yeah. Yeah. Only to still lose to Shifter in the modern era. Yep. That's why it needs to be on the list in August. Yeah. Please God. Yeah. There's if you do one thing for us, Konami, ban Shifter. Everyone is sick of it. Everyone dislikes the card. Please just get rid of it. It's degenerate. I mean they've been on the trend with floodgates, right? They just haven't started touching hand trap floodgates like Droll or Shifter and yep, stuff like correct. that. But that might be the direction. Secret, secret. Uh, dude, oh, dear. the onk, dude. dude. Just feel blessed we've only pulled two so far. <sighs> At this point, could have been a lot worse. Yeah, yeah. There's a stellar. Uh, okay, not bad. 
We've only pulled, what, two Stellar and one LZ so far, I think. Yeah. Lightwoods is a little light, but that's fine. Rather have the ones that are money. Would rather have the theme smith. The better cards anyway. Yeah. Oh, whacked your mic cover. It's fine. Didn't shut off, so we're good. Mic check, one, two, one, two. <clears throat> All right, so we need minimum one more Mulcharmy just to hit the and ratios. Engraver. And then a fourth <clears throat> engraver would be solid, dude. Oh, Whitewood's, uh, Whitewood's mm -hmm. search spell. You're on, you're on your last box, and I have one more box. And we'll just open Maker. Our last. Good deal. All right. Almost done. You're on the last few of yours, and I just got one more box. Take, uh, we'll go 50 50 here. This is here. This here. here. Got a dungeon. Pulled a lot of those. I don't know. That might only be like three, maybe four with the QCR. Not a ton. It's at least more relevant than some of the ultras, I will say. with a bang here that would be like, i'm yeah, telling you man this this box mulcharmy engraver and qc engraver just in one box we got a trap oh there you go that's uh it's only two track though actually that's true mario has my other one mm. and my other engraver mm. yeah shout out to all the the ohio people going to nats man yeah, good luck bring it home boys and girls more you might have one more ultra at the bottom of yours maybe maybe yes, sure. not terrible all right we're on the last box oh there's your second sang engine oh wow he's made a rare appearance this i know it's only two open this open we need one more QC, dude. We do. We need another that'd be, QC. That'd be pretty good. Pretty good. We need another QC. Make. I should be coming up on a secret here. In a couple of packs. You said what seventh spot? Yep. This might be a secret then where I'm at. It is a rock one. Could be better, but it's not terrible. I don't really want play sets of the extra deck stuff, but uh, you know it is what it is. We need that engraver, Mimical. Mimical master. We do need an engraver. We need a QC or an engraver, or a QC engraver. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, wait. Where'd that track come from? My box or your old box? Because that might be it, right? Two secrets a box. Uh, which one? The track. The track came from the old box. Oh, okay. Yeah, then you still have a secret. Yes, I should. I think I still have one. Yeah. Slide yours up a little bit for that last secret. If it comes up for this one. That's a onk. Disgusting. Boo. Can we pull a third secret? Oh, Dark Condition. We'll pull QCR. Or that. Or that. Finish with a QCR. Uh, this is the last pack on my side, and you got a few left. QCR. No. Vidulcha. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Super. Ultra. Ultra. <laughs>
Not terrible, dude. Not 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 terrible. We'll uh, we'll not highlight terrible. stuff in a minute yeah. here. We'll yeah. sleeve some yeah. stuff up. People who just want to see everything one at a time. Uh, QC, one engraver for people who need to keep track of that. One Mulcharmy. I think that's two of the Alistair one. One LZ. I think we actually did get three caveman. It's either two or three. Mm. Um, oh, no. Two LZ, I think, and two Alistair at this point. Yeah. I think we did. We pulled a lot of white. I think we pulled more white wood stuff than you think. Yeah. Engraver number two. I think that's either rabbit one or two. Woo. QC. Rabbit number two. Engraver number two three. or three. That might be, I don't three. know. Three. Uh, second Mulcharmy. First ish tract, I think. QC. I think that's the second one of these, maybe. That's definitely a third Requiem. Where's the QC record? Uh, it's in this, yeah. Uh, second tract. Yeah, definitely three caveman. Yeah. yeah, so I think, because how many engravers did you pull? Three, I think. Three. I think it's three. We'll see. Yeah, we'll I'm go back out. and check. I'm just going to care about the relevant ones. I'm just doing Sangin Jin as the only ultra here. I'm just going to put all the ultras aside and just do the secrets first. Yeah. We'll see if we get some QCs to us. Yeah. Millennium. Awful, dude. Yeah, awful. It's just play set it on. I was hoping to avoid it. Yeah. All right, let me see what you got here. Another QC. Rabbit here yeah, for people. There you go. There's a better idea. Engraver, tract, QC, QC. Just gonna hand me those ultras also then. Yeah. Show me. Yeah, we did do three engraver. That's solid. Third QC, and then another requiem. So here's the secrets for people who want to know. Three engraver, two rabbit, two Mulcharmy, uh, two of the Sang Engine. I just put this ultra here because it's relevant. There might be a third one hiding somewhere. Two of the Diabels. Yeah, take those. And then, uh, oh, we actually have three of the Whitewood Synchro. Two Track, three Ankh, three Purge, three QCs, two LZ, two Alstar, and then two Requiem, one QC. Not, not terrible. I mean, three engraver was the minimum expectation. I'm just kind of a little sad we didn't hit three tracked and three Mulcharmy, but uh, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. But yeah, guys, this is the case opening. Um, let me know what you guys think. This is a really cool experience for me to do, um, and I hope that you guys enjoyed just hanging out, watching this. Hopefully, maybe got to be able to share in that experience, but uh, we'll have a lot of really cool deck profiles, of course, coming soon with all of the stuff from Infinite Forbidden, but with all that said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.